we are back at the Park Plaza Hotel in Boston, Massachusetts with Mr. Greg Smith. Hello. How do you do? And Mr. Andrew Singett. Hi, Chris. So we are going to discuss what happened in the recent Peter Eggleston Pro Standard Cup at the DBDC in Boston. So let's find out what happened. Two, four, three, two, two. Our runners up actually came all the way from Salt Lake City. We had Oscar and Carolina. Greg. Who says boring comps are boring? <laughs> it was very, very interesting. Um, for me, they were my winners on the night, Oscar and Carolina. They, um, they did what I, I, I want to see. I thought that they were the, the most musical couple in the swing dancers. They used the, the musicality, that they filled the music out and therefore I thought um, that they should win. But they didn't. But that's fine. But um, there was a good couple and um, they are a good couple and they dance well. Okay, Andrew. I give this couple two first. I think they're also uh, a very nice couple. I think they're a very dedicated couple. They they train very hard. They work hard. They try to do competitions all over the world to 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 network and be in place and dance with all the best couples in the world. I think their attitude is is uh, very very good. Um, yeah, I gave them two first. I didn't see them as clear winners this evening. I think that uh, the key for their future is improvement from the boy because I think the girl is, has a champion, champion credentials for sure and uh, presented beautifully, dress, makeup, everything perfect. So for me, I would like to see, yeah, I see the future development for this boy will be through, future development through result will be through the boy's improvement. I gave them two firsts and um, at times the floor was busy, not the biggest floor, but uh, interestingly enough, I marked them first in the quick step <laughs> because I felt as though that they handled the floor and the music the best. All right. Also, um, as a young, uh, uh, coming from the amateurs as well. So they're just recent professionals and they've done very, very well at Blackpool. And now with all the competitions they're doing in America, going well. Oh, once again, what are the things that I, in golf, Okay, so you play over in America at the Masters, you win, you go to the British Open, yeah. or should I just say the Open, and it's a whole different ball game. So yes, the floor here is actually, it's not small, but it's not big either. So it was interesting that you give them first and quick step, yeah. because, well, they were equally the biggest couple on the floor, they, tallest. They handled it in the best way, in the best manner. They had the best control at that speed and also with the music. They the, therefore, they had the best skill. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else before I take the bike away? Well, yeah, I think it's, uh, it's right that you've noticed that I said that, that in the quick set, biggest, biggest couple, quite a, a little bit s s smallish, but yeah, you're right, definitely danceable. But uh, at that speed, they controlled it uh, very well and I thought the most skillful. But also I'd like to say that, the, that it, it's such a beautiful ballroom as well. The floors, it, it's, it's definitely big enough for sure. Um, but the, the whole atmosphere was wonderful and it's just so lovely to be in such a room to dance a competition in. Fantastic. All right, guys. Well done. Who won this crazy event? Let's find out. Okay, guys, uh, we need a quick break, but we will be back soon with more from the pro from the Peter Eggleton Pro Standard Cup at the DBDC in Boston.